The Salt Pond Oil Field was established some 65 years ago. The field, which was discovered by Signal Amoko Consortium, was managed by the Salt Pond Offshore Producing Company. The field produced about 3,600 barrels of crude oil per day. However, in 2010, production took a nosedive. This necessitated the move by GNPC to halt operations of the field to avoid incurring operational cost. This meant that the rig used for the production of the oil had to be decommissioned. The former Minister for Energy, John Peter Mew, attempted to decommission the rig in 2019, but the rig remains in 2021. It has been in a such a bad state and in the waters for so many years. Um, the rig has rusted and um, we fear that there could be a very bad uh, environmental um, incident or disaster very soon if nothing is done. The reason is that normally when you have a producing well and there's no more um, oil being produced from these wells, what happens is that you go, uh, you go into the subsea and cap that well and then leave it. The Institute of Energy Policies and Research is concerned about the situation. If you have even 100 barrels of crude oil gushing up into the sea every day, that's going to be a problem. Then you look at the gas that will come out from these wells, which could spark fire and it could be a disaster. The rig, which is not safe, have staff of GMPC on there and their lives, even if one person dies as a result of a disaster, that's a loss of life that is not necessary. The Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, says it is taking steps to decommission the oil rig. Its executive director, Henry Kokofu, spoke to City News. In the meantime, we have asked my officers to get there and then we cordon the area uh, so we don't, people don't get access closer to uh, what is left on the shore uh, in order to uh, contain uh, the precautionary measures, I mean safety measures that will forestall any accident. So by this we are appealing to the general public particularly um, our compatriots who are uh, in that community who are host to these facilities to be extra careful not to toy with uh, what is there. Uh, the danger is so high. Uh, so we will get uh, our acts together and if need be compel uh, GMPC to speed up uh, the decommissioning uh, processes.